Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to RimWorld. Sort of. So, here's the deal. So, the DLC and 1.4 are going to be coming out soon. Actually, 1.4 is going to be coming out in just a couple days, but that isn't going to affect us, because this is a standalone copy. Um, and so, I didn't want to start over again. My plan had been to take these colonists, or at least most of them, plunk them in a different part of the world, and then unlock some tech so we don't all have to sit around and, like, reinvent batteries and stuff like that. But I've decided to go a different direction, because I want to continue this, and I kind of screwed myself the way I set things up. So, you may notice this mech cluster is gone. We're never going to worry about them again. They're gone. And, <laughs> I've changed a bunch of other stuff in here. So first of all, um, Conan is no longer a Psycaster. Instead, I have moved their powers over to Rhino, and I was really disappointed with the lightning thing, so instead we're going Technomats around this guy. So here's some cool stuff. You can increase the quality of a thing, which I haven't done yet, or you can um, repair an item. And I really think that I probably should have gone the other way. And here in the middle, oh, I still have points left. Oh, I have a point. Oh, cool. Okay. Haywire. Yes, that'll be cool. That'll be much more useful against mechs. Um, I can make a steel construct. This is going to be interesting. So this will follow them around and defend them from harm. So I feel like this will be a lot along the lines of, let's say, I don't know, a loyal animal, I think. We'll find out. Um, I'm also going to have word of progress here, so they'll get double research speed and intellectual skill gain. If I go the other way, I'll get a siring, so I can give people um, another, you know, siring, and then they can take the talent and learn it. Amusingly, you can chain this. You can grant siring to somebody, and then they can use that to get siring and pass it on, but we're not gonna do that. That's a little silly. And then when I get up to the top here, I can reverse engineer stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna need this, but it's okay, because the rest of this stuff is pretty fun. So yeah, so I shuffled meditation spots around. Um, I didn't change much else in the base. Kind of to compensate for this, I destroyed a bunch of stuff, uh, a lot of stuff actually. So most of our wealth is gone. And since I'm behind where I should be, I did add a couple halfway decent weapons. A few other things that did happen. Mysteriously, that smoke camp is gone as well. Hmm. Wonder what happened to them. But we're not going to worry about it. So, this is blatant cheating. I want to be real upfront about this. Like, this is not... I'm not trying to explain any of this away. There's no retconning. This is cheating because I want to keep playing with this colony, because I like it. And I don't want to start over at, like, episode 12. Like, you know, we're just kind of starting to get to know people. We're really just kind of... We're getting up near the inflection point where our power is really going to take off. I don't want to have to regrow everything. So that's the plan. So I also changed then some work priorities around. Rhino is the one that I think I can let meditate all day. My crafter? No. Like, I can't let my crafter sit around all day. That was a poor decision on my part. So growing might suffer a little bit, but Kim should take over for it. So should be all right. Maybe. This should be interesting. <laughs> <laughs> and we were researching something, but I don't remember what. What were we doing? I don't know. Hospital beds? That was probably it. Okay. So, if you rage quit this, I understand completely. But I hope you won't. This was cotton. Didn't I set up some hay grass somewhere? Oh, I just forgot. No, that, that's right. That was after this. So you need to be hay grass. And so that's right. So, yeah. So that's where we are. I don't know why this giant smoke cloud's not going away. Because it says that, but you can see there's no effect from it. Oh, there we go. Okay, just had to tick. Cool. And I think I'm going to expand this glowvine area even more. I think I'm going to fill in here. Because this stuff takes so long to grow. And I need so much of it. Just tons of it. Here, do do that to begin with. And we'll move on. We'll move on from there. So, yeah. Cool. Well, I should probably go ahead and chop down these trees. Uh, chop wood. Will that catch them all? Yep. Mostly. Yep, there we go. That way our constructors won't be doing it, and it takes forever. Actually, now that everyone is up and about, 
Rhino, why don't you come... Oh, here, this should be set to like 75% or something. At least, maybe 80. Why don't you come get a construct? To be implanted in steel slag. Okay, I don't think I have any steel slag, but I have some over here. Let's see what this does. I'm really curious about this. All right, buddy. Whoa. Cool. And it follows them around. If I break the link, it immediately kills it. Okay. Cool. It's pretty slow. So that's not terribly useful, but <laughs> that's awesome. I mean, it's really unuseful, except for maybe battle. Yeah, like, what's the deal with this? What's your speed? 4.6, that's not... Are you, it's just because you're wandering? Yeah, you have the same movement speed. Okay, okay so it's just because you're wandering. Okay. Neat. See, cool things are fun. Okay, hospital beds are done. Let's see here. Could do something weird like, I don't know, biosculpting. So I have all these things unlocked for Pawn Morpher, but I don't have any of the raw materials. <laughs> so that's why I'm kind of looking more at this kind of stuff. Oh, you know what I could do? Let's learn how to make tea. Oh, I don't have any tea. <gasps> this is a disaster. Well, I suppose I wouldn't know how to make tea until now, anyway. Tea grass. But, crap. Um... What can I do? Okay, these are potatoes. I, 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 don't, I don't care about that. So, instead of that, let's shrink the zone. <laughs> Why are you up there? I don't remember doing that. I mean, obviously I did it, but... Is that gonna be enough? No, it's not. There. Now, things should be way better. Whew. What a disaster that would have been, right? Oh, and I can go ahead and reconnect this. Some of these plants are actually just... Oh my god, this stuff is done! <gasps> now that is exciting, so I can finally start making some hazmat stuff for my growers. You know, assuming they bring the stuff inside at some point. There we go, espresso machines. Alright, so. Now we can make tea. I'll set that up. Um... I do want to work my way down here towards more exciting bits and pieces. I could build... Can I build a multi-analyzer? No, that's right, it needs plasteel. Okay. Um, let's see here. See, my people despise gun turrets. I like using them as early trip warnings. Maybe... Let's, let's do hydroponics. Okay, I'm just trying to move things around in here so that, like... Um, I can put it in, like, a billiards table and stuff. Protecting aristocrats. Alright, so the Red Sovereignty wants to stay here for 17 days with five alloys. We'll get a bunch of mechanoids. No. Oh. Oh, um. Um... Hmm. I'll think about that. I have seven days to think about it. A monosword. Ooh, that would be... That'd be a hell of a thing. That's for sure. Alright, so what stupid things have I not done back here? 
I'll need rail refining or er, rail stuff at some point. Um, mm, smoke pump. Those actually are pretty good. Oh, IEDs for some hilarity in the future. Now I need someone running this. This is crafting. So who do I want to fall through to that? Growing, plant cutting, and meditating. And you're arting, but you suck at crafting. Warden Handel Hall. Let's try that and let's see what happens. The problem is the animals can't haul food. Alright, IDs. This stuff is going fast. Um, a shield belt would be nice. Let's get that done. And check it out, we have some antigens! Yay! So I set up a bill to make some has silk. Nobody's done it yet. But I have faith that they will. Probably. Eventually you're gonna fall through this, right? Oh, you're making chem fuel. That's right. I really wish this increased, like, your crafting, but you're the only person that I can spare all the time. So, here we are. Hey, you got another silent already. Cool. Well, let's take a look at you here, buddy. So... Okay, I've got myself sorted out. Um, I was confused as to what was going on here. So, this is correct, because you're going down Necropath. And I think you should have two points. So first of all, we're going to get Word of Fear. That's awesome. And then... Let's see here... Make them rot. Steal vitality. Huh, that's pretty cool. Corpse talk. Target a corpse and temporarily appropriate their skills. Oh, that's something I want a lot. Yep, we'll take that. Thank you very much. I don't have any corpses around at the moment. Actually, wasn't there one down here from someone who had gotten in an unrelated fight? Yeah, I think that they're... Yeah, these are too far gone. Let's find out, though. Um, shouldn't you have psychasts up? There we go. Wait, was this guy any good? I should find that out first. Uh, sure. I just want to see how it works, basically. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Neat. I wish I'd looked ahead of time what your skills were. <laughs> oh, check out that cool effect. Also, um, he's riding around the steel construct here and there, which is pretty cool. Unfortunately, I cannot rename it. I tried. So, sorry just stays steel construct number one. All right, and these guys are getting pretty close. Has anyone made the has silk yet? No, come on. I wish I could prioritize this over this, but they're both just like the same job slot. Wait, shouldn't chem fuel be going here? It should now. <laughs> you're non-violent here. You're using a punching bag? Really? Alright, that was supposed to be for, you know, my melee, but whatever. Both good straighter. Okay, cool. Actually, wait, hold on. Hold on. Are you guys going to trigger this really old mech cluster? No, because it doesn't have a proximity sensor. Oh, well. Wait, why didn't you make the has silk? 40 cloth, 1 antigen. Okay. Well, I guess we'll figure it out. Oh, you guys will probably have some plasteel and then we can build the multi analyzer. That'd be kind of cool. 
Mad Gigantelope. Okay. Here, we'll make them walk all the way around. Oh, and Clavin, you're up. Um, again, doing the wrong thing, but why don't you come trade at these people? Okay, so, what do we got here? Well, I guess we're just gonna sum some various garbage. And I see that someone is wandering down here, so I should probably bring down some back up. Let's see here. You just stay here for a second. So bring everybody else through here. Actually, come down here. More, come here. Um, Tanya, come here. Okay, there should be plenty of firepower. Ah, Rhino, quick run away. You're in a bad spot. What a cool sound. There, perfect. Good job, team. Oh, you're making the head silk. Okay, so I couldn't tell how big of a stack this was. Oh, this doesn't lose any from the 40. <gasps> That's so cool. Protects from mutagenic weaponry and other mutagenic hazards. Yay! So apparently we need three things. So let's make pants, a button-down shirt. You can make dusters. Okay, alright. So I've got those three set up. Um... That'll be for two growers. So that'll be these two. That'll be Kim and Rhino. I'll make them, let's see here. I'll make them some growing only clothing. And then they won't keep mutating themselves. And that's great. All right, shields are up, good. I don't know if I'm gonna make any of those, but it's, well, I'll make one, obviously. Let's see here. Oh, I don't have precision rifling done? Yeah, I do. Oh, it's the multi-analyzer. Bah! Hmm... Well, we'll learn how to run before we learn how to walk. We'll keep researching some of this other stuff. And I think I may just start making some exploratory drill sites. I'm not really happy about that. I don't like doing those. Especially not like, you know, kind of near my base. But... Oh, a Manhunter pack. Arcturian Sky Eels. How many are we talking? Nine. Okay, you know what? I'm not even going to bother having you guys do anything. Let me just make sure everything changed over. Um, animal safety. Right. Okay. And I only have a couple doors, so I'm just gonna lock them. That way people won't try to leave or do anything stupid like that. So I need to build a tunnel down here, apparently. <laughs> or something like that. Is that really the sound that you make in the wild? I don't come across a lot of sky eels, to be honest, so... Maybe. Man, I wish I could rename these guys. Who got the plague? Fatigue has plague. Well, that's not good. I lost my little post-it note that had who is what. Tanya. Come tend. 58%. Yeah. Um, let's actually, let's expand your area. Animal safety, yeah. Oh, this one's set as medical, that's why. There we go, perfect. Okay, now you'll get tended in here. Poor little guy. 
Oh, hey, Condit and Kim are going to get married. Awesome. Let me write that down here. Okay, so they are no engaged. Cool. Congrats. I'm just making this area bigger. Just kind of out of boredom. A royal tribute collector. Oh, they're coming in from the direction of the... Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Or are the skies still around? Yeah, they are. Yeah, come on up. You guys can take care of this, not me. Just watch them fight. Hmm. You guys are not doing great. <laughs> and then there's more. Wow. You guys are getting ruined. Note to self, do not engage these guys in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Well, whatever your stuff can I take? I can take that. I can take that. Obviously all the survival meals. I don't really care about the rest of the weapons. I mean, I'm going to come down and rescue them if I can. Um, I don't want to take the meals back because people tend to get food poisoning from them. Well, all right, all right. We'll come take them. Cool. All right, so, refugees. Hmm, they want to stay here for 15 days. They'll work for free. Hmm. Um, sure, I've got four days. I'll get that set up. I'm just kind of moving some walls around in here. Can I make you guys a nicer looking place? I don't believe I can. Yeah. What with this whole thing going on here? Okay, good. So this is tile. Let's put some more flooring in here. Let's do that. Let's reinstall this over here. There we go. Make that a little bigger for no particular reason. This is just like locked in busy work, you know? Like we have nothing else to do, so let's do this. I mean, I could put them in barracks. Like down here. And I could make it a nice barrack, too. Yeah, I could do that. Do I have enough wood for this? Oh, yeah. So I need one, two. Well, not if I want headboards. Yes, I can. Okay, good. Do you have any stone left? Oh yeah, I've got tons of this stuff left. Unfortunately, people will have to walk through there. <laughs> um, but it's okay. I mean, I guess I could put another door on somewhere else. But I kind of can't be bothered... Put a wooden door on here. We'll put a vent in once that's been built. Not that these have been strictly necessary or anything, but it's good to have them, you know? Yeah, I mean, I guess I could take this apart and move the door over. Yeah, let's do that. Fatigue, how are you doing, buddy? Oh, you're fine. Okay, good. What? Why? Oh, yeah. Because I haven't moved this over. Well... La di da, aren't we so special that we can't have our statue in the same place? See, I need to wait for most of the sky eels to go away. Actually, are they still on the map? No, okay. So, you guys, let me un unforbid here. I'm sure I'll be excited about that. Can we come rescue any of these people to get some rep? We can. In fact, I think we have to. Bleeds out in 22 hours. That's not good. Yeah. Any of these other people that I could save? Nope. Oh, yeah, this one. No, wait. I've got people coming down to save them, right? Yep. Good, hooray for rep. 
Please don't be bonded. <gasps> it's not bonded. Oh my god. And a Zeus hammer? No. Oh my god. Oh, you're going to die anyway, from all these infections. Well, maybe. But probably another man- what? A whole bunch of cats, okay. But, did that monosword get brought in? And the Zeus hammer get brought in? Yep, okay. Alright, well, is anybody outside? Yes. I don't want to interrupt their tending, but I think I have to. I don't want to deal with a bunch of cats at the moment. I don't really care about any of the rest of this stuff. Tanya, you are not going to believe what just happened. You got a monosword. That's right. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, this is exciting. Wait, what do you have for gear? Okay. So cool. All right, where'd all the cats end up? They're down here too, huh? I think there's a lot of you. 22 cats? That's a lot of cats. I wish more of this had gotten planted, but we kind of didn't have time. Why is this glow vine? Muta brambles. <laughs> um. Oh, well, that's cool. I don't think I'd seen that yet. Mutant bush, whatever. Anyway, just just put some corn down here or something the next time you get down there. I should grow some muta brambles just to see what they do. Let's do that. Let's set up a growing zone. Oh, that's right. Most of this is stone over here. Is there any? Yeah, but that's okay. I still want to see what they look like. Muta brambles. At some point. Actually, I think you guys are going to pull through. Mm, I'm going to need to throw one extra bag in here. Or one extra bed in here for when I accept that quest. Hey, fatigue's all better. Yay! Good deal. There you go. Injectors. Um, since we're killing time here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, transport pods. I forgot about those. I don't know what boring things can I have you guys do. There's, like, nothing more boring around here. I mean... I could keep moving this back until I run into walls. Or, I'm sorry, until I run into mountain. And then have it look big and cool. Maybe there's some rituals we can do? What did I build this out of? Oh, marble, and I don't have any more marble, do I? <sighs> huh. Well, I can't find it anyway, so... Large tile. Marble, large tile. Okay. No. Okay, well, I probably just passed right over it, but I I don't know. Let's just use just paved tiles for the moment, just so there is, like, a floor in there. Maybe I could give a leader speech or something? I don't know. Are those cats still here? Yeah. Um. Sure. I must begin... Must assign High Stellark. And I can't just do it like this? Yeah. Alright, and it was encouraging. Neat. Well, that means you get a point. So wait, who got a point? Does everybody get a point? 
Okay, that must not be what I'm thinking of. Never mind. Cargo pods. Yeah. Um, we have some of the has silk stuff getting made. Um, they don't wear it by default, so I've kind of had to force it onto people. And that's okay. Come on, cat. Shouldn't you be dying or something or whatever? We have things to do. Oh, here we go. The advent of family. Okay. Light ball. Okay, so apparently I don't need one. Um. Select a focus object. You know what? I could do this in here. That'd be kind of cool. Wouldn't it? Maybe? We'll try that in the morning. Okay, now that everybody's up, let's do this. So... Advent of Family. I have a lot of options here. Advent of Family. 45%. Well... Oh well. That was good? Huh. Okay. Okay, they're finally moving off the map. Depressive. Yeah. Man, I can see that. And I would like to come kill some of these guys, actually. Um, okay. The problem is, I can't build that stupid, um, multi-analyzer. There, are you guys finally going away? Yes. Okay. That took forever. I don't know if I could have taken them or not, but I'm glad I didn't check. And these guys are going to pull through, by the way. In fact, you guys are looking pretty good. Good, good, good. Free wrap. Yes. More cargo pods. Uh, sure. Why not? It's really funny watching people ride the, um, steel construct around. It is faster. Wait, I turned this off. Why didn't you guys switch back? Okay, there we go. Okay, how can I make this area look a little nicer? Um, I could gank a statue or two. That would be fine. I think my big statue is one of the ones I deleted. So these are both the radical ones, so I can't move those. But I could take... Oh, that one too. But I could take one of these... One of the small ones away. I mean... I could make a sculpture. A brutal sculpture. Sculpture of an animal? That sounds adorable. Because I want this to at least be like a very impressive barrack. Okay. Hmm, since you're all up and I can borrow you. Um... Except for Clavin, obviously. And actually, Tanya, you can keep working too, whatever it is you're doing. The rest of you guys, let's come over here. Or no, I've changed your mind. Tanya, you come here too. And let's come kill this entire herd. This is going to get us murdered. But maybe with our entire group, we can pull it off. Plus, you guys are like fighting something else at the moment. Okay, so with the exception of Tanya then. Crap. Ah, crap. Okay. Alright. Now, are there anything... Is there anything useful I could use here? Chain bolt, actually. Oh, that's right. Nobody has it anymore. Oh, but you still have the buttons. You just can't use them. 
Well, that won't be confusing at all. Okay, great. Yeah, not much I can do here. Good job, team. Did you get any serious injuries from that? Nope. And nope. Cool. Good, we need some leather. Excellent. Trillax ranged weapon. No, you don't. You just haven't equipped it yet. Oh, tired refugees. Time for refugees. I almost forgot about them. Uh, yeah. Welcome. Come on in. So you guys, what are we looking at here? Mm, oh, a backup doctor, that's good. I'm gonna leave you down a ways because I don't want you to get the skill points from it. Let's see here. You know, I could use this guy as a backup researcher, but since we don't have the thing for it, doesn't really matter, so I'll have you craft. And that should be... I don't know. Okay. And if you guys mine down at zero. I don't really have a lot of use for you guys, actually. I don't know, just, just, do, just do something like that. I don't really care. Oh, I didn't even look at you guys, so... Scratch Scar, K. Teetotaler, yeah, I don't care. You won't put out fire, that's interesting. Hmm. Okay, so, um, let's get some of you guys ranged weapons so I don't forget. We're not a bad shot. Why don't you come get the heavy SMG? I really don't want to give you guys assault rifles. You guys are terrible shots. But this is a good way to get rid of some extra weapons, so... Actually, do anything in here I don't care about? Shotguns, revolvers, that would be nice to get rid of those. Let's get rid of the revolvers. There you go. And you guys can just go right ahead and keep those. Tender apparel, I don't care. I'll get to you in a bit. There we go, see, 22. Yay! That is awesome. Oh, oh my god, I'm already at a colony wealth. <gasps> oh, I gotta fix that. I gotta fix that soon. Uh-oh. <laughs> that is a lot of colony wealth for where I'm at for not having any plasteel. Let's do a little bit of exploratory mining. It's a hassle, but we need some plasteel. And I want to do it kind of away from our area. We can go through here, I suppose. Like, bugs will already come out here, but I don't want to make it any worse. <laughs> here, do, do that and see if you hit anything. I kind of wish you guys would come plant. Don't I have two growers that you should be hitting first? Oh, that's right. Rhino is not going to be growing most of the time. So really, it's just Kim. Well... No... It, it'll, it'll be okay. They'll figure it out. Oh, that's cool. All right. Well, I tell you what, hopefully cheat day one has gone okay with you. Um, clearly I'm being punished with Condent having these skills that he shouldn't have, so that will confuse the crap out of me. Um, these three guests aren't super useful, but, you know, I can keep them entertained. They can actually help me shift my base a little more. I want to move storage down here and, I don't know, kind of expand a little, kind of around in a big giant semicircle. Uh, I, I, I couldn't tell you why, I just think it'll look neat, so there's that. 
So anyway, on that note, thanks for watching. See you next time.